All right, so here we have the 2023 Forest River Aurora 26BH. Uh, lots of cool features on this camper. Uh, starting with the fact of, of safety and security, construction. Uh, this thing is, is built on the Narco electromagnetic powder coated chassis. Uh, this is nice and strong, put together very well. It's got the screwed cabinet construction with the pocket board lumber core slides. It's got the drop edge thermofoil seamless countertops, not that old T-mold system you see in some of, some of these campers. Oh, that's that in itself is a great feature. Get a better shot there, so we can get it all, get the whole camper in the shot there. Uh, this is going to have a six foot nine inch uh, interior height. Uh, it's got a thirteen thousand five hundred BTU GE ducted air conditioner. Uh, it's got a six gallon gas electric uh, water heater with a sixteen gallon quick recovery, sixteen gallon per hour quick recovery system attached with that uh, 5 8 inch tongue and groove floor 5 8 inch plywood bed base dinette base and backers in the walls and shower base you got the full length frame e-coated outriggers uh, seamless roof membrane with an 18 year warranty you've got the water water heater bypass winterization kit uh, self-adjusting brakes you got a 35,000 BTU furnace with a two-year uh, two warranty. Uh, you got universal solar prep with roof and charge controller connections and your wiring is already done for you. It's got the magnetic baggage door latches, friction door hinge, so if the wind's blowing, it, it's not gonna slam the door. Uh, it's got the black tank flush to keep that cleaned out. And that's gonna reduce odors inside the camper. Uh, it's got nitrogen field radial tires this is going to have two 20 pound propane tanks you've got your rear view camera prep on the front of this camper you're going to have the diamond plate rock guard on the inside you've got the aurora one control monitor panel with the lca lci app uh, jbl entertainment package you got a full ge kitchen suite which is going to give you the GE 10.7 uh, cubic foot uh, 12 volt refrigerator, the GE stainless three burner gas range. It's gonna give you the GE stainless microwave. Uh, you got LED interior lighting. You got underbed storage with separation from the outside storage, which let's take a quick look at that while we're right here at it. You can see your outside storage and You've got that separation there. When we go inside, you're gonna see underbed storage, but it's not gonna lead out here. So you've got that separation there. Let's go inside this camper and take a look. All right, so we come inside, we see a very classic design for our bunk models, which is gonna be your sofa here. That's gonna jackknife down into a bed. And back here, you've got your bed behind that. Uh, you've got your two, uh, Closets, if you will, nightstands on both sides, windows on both sides. Coming around, you've got storage up above. You've got your sink. There's your three burner range, along with your microwave and your refrigerator. All GE appliances, by the way. You got your big double bunks, big enough for two adults. Or 14 children, you could really pile the kids on those things. Look at that. Yeah. So lots of room for the kiddos there. And I was just kidding about 14 kids. Um, but uh, when we used to go camping, we we packed a lot of kids on these things. Uh, but then you got storage up above here. A beautiful window there at the dinette. That dinette, of course, also turns into a bed. And then coming back around, you've got the jackknife sofa we were talking about. One hand operation lifts that right up. Underneath, you're gonna have storage underneath that sofa. And using my one hand, I'm gonna turn that, that couch into a bed. So you got another sleeping surface there. In the bedroom, under the bed, you're gonna have storage there. And it is separate. You do have separation between the underbed storage and the pass-through storage underneath. Uh, that's gonna help 
uh, with insulation. It's going to help keep things that are under the bed cleaner than stuff that may be in the pass-through storage where it's closer to the outside. may have more dirt and debris. You don't want that coming into the camper under the mattress, right? So very, very cool feature there. So great camper. Um, this is the Aurora 26 BH. Uh, one of the most popular floor plans in America, which again is going to be the uh, bed, the sofa, along with your dinette, and your big double bunks there in the back. <clears throat> we didn't even look at the bathroom. Let's take a look here. And you're going to see on this particular model, as opposed to some other models, you're going to see the sink in here with the toilet and the shower. A lot of Floor plans like this are going to give you the bathtub, uh, the, the, the shower rather, the shower with the toilet on the inside, and then you go out of the bathroom to access the sink. One thing that's cool about this is the sink is right here in with uh, the bathroom. So that's a neat little feature on this one. Uh, not that it's a big deal either way, but some folks do have preferences there. Some folks prefer the sink on the outside of the bathroom. That way you can have someone using the sink while someone else is in the bathroom. I guess it's personal preference, but this one is set up to where it is in the bathroom. So, great little camper here. If you want more information, please feel free to reach out. My number is 434-238-3001. Again, that's 434-238-3001. And this is Charlie, the RV camper guy here at blue compass of danville virginia thanks and until next time y'all take care